Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. First and foremost, thank you so much. I wanted to let you guys all know that I love and appreciate every single one of you. So thank you guys for coming to check me out. If you are new, welcome. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, that like button, and the notification bell. That way you never miss when I upload. I upload constantly. And I'm also uh, periodically going live. So anything that is pertaining to my channel, guys, it'll always be linked down below all of my social medias how to donate to my channel how to send payment if you want to book something personal with me all of that will be linked down below all right so let's get into the readings guys but i also just really quickly want to let you know that these are always general readings so they may or may not resonate with you take what you need and leave the rest if you vibe very well with my energy and you want to book something personal like i said please do not hesitate to reach out and energy can be past present future so it could be something going on that happened in your past or it could be currently going on or it could be happening okay so with all that being said let's jump right in let's do this taurus okay i don't know why i always sing when i do your guys' sign it's hilarious okay so taurus welcome to your career money and finance read for july so I'm going to use my goddess oracle to get overall energy in regards to you guys like with this and then we'll kind of take a peek and I'll see what I feel um, drawn to pull. All right, but I will end with a crystal message for you guys as well. So let's take a peek and see. All right, so for my Tauruses, what do we got as far as overall energy as far as career money finance? What do we got? What do we got for my Tauruses? blossoming you are just getting started so have patience with yourself in the process and do not give up yeah so and it's funny because this is in regards to a lot of you who have finally decided to take a risk on like creativity so for a lot of you i've been getting a lot like cooking um a, a baking for some like lo like loving sweets and um for a lot of others of you too like creativity um it could be in the aspect of making things you know um like candles herbs things like that jewelry for some of you um but yeah so let's see so is there anything else my tourists need to know as far as maybe something that they don't know that they're good at something that maybe they should be knowing that they should be doing let's take a peek and see so let's see what other messages we have for Taurus. Let's see. I just ordered a new career deck as well. And so, oh, I can't wait for it to get here. It might take a couple weeks, but I think for August, I should be good. So I'm excited. What else for my Tauruses? Teachings popping up really strongly here, especially like when it comes to children. So there could be some of you who might have like apprentices that you could have like at your job or something. Like for some of you, I'm getting like if you work outside or maybe some of you, if you like own your own business, I'm getting that there's a younger person around some of you that is going to be kind of like an apprentice. Um, so a lot of you, I'm getting... Um, own like your own businesses and those of you who own your business like i said like some of you might either have like maybe younger children that you're that you're like teaching things um but i'm getting that very strongly i'm getting very strongly that there are children around a lot of you guys that you guys can teach like there's a lot of lessons that you can teach these young children around you like these young energies and it's also too more about grounding as well if that makes sense like for a lot of you, I'm seeing you guys teaching also like the kids like grounding, you know, like uh, the importance of playing outside or being outside and putting away electronics and things like that. I'm getting that energy um, like really strongly for a lot of you, especially in regards to, like I said, teaching and, um, and and kids like learning. And those of you who, like I said, have businesses, like you have like young apprentices, things like that. Like there's a younger energy around you. Okay. 
There also is a very big energy of, of uh, a little bit of blockage here when it comes to money because there's some of you who are like not letting something go that needs to be let go. There's something that some of you are holding on to and the more that you hold on to it, the less blossoming happens. You know what I mean? Because things are coming and they're, they're, they're just kind of pushing forward here, right? Like they're saying, you're just getting started. Things are just starting to come in, but there's a really, really strong energy and importance here of letting something go. There's something that needs to be let go here. It could be a person I'm getting for some of you, but for some of you, it could be too, uh, maybe like a, a client or like a contract or something, like something that's been weighing heavy kind of like on your heart and you've been thinking about it because like it's like you don't want to like affect something. They're literally saying, nope, it's you can let it go. Like it's not you. It's, you know, it's the energy that you definitely need. to. You obviously feel that way for a reason, obviously, right? Like it's been eating at you. So it's the energy that definitely needs to be let go. Okay. So let's see. Let's get you guys also some money messages. Let's get some money messages as well. Perfect time to invest. That's popping up again this month. Investing. See, some of you are not listening. Some of you are not doing it. Uh, money munchers. Uh, they're eating all your bread. Yeah, see, there's people here who are really... Okay, so do you see... Okay, so you see how they were saying, like, there's something here, right, that needs to be let go. Like, there's an energy of letting something go. This is, like, it's more of, like, a karmic. Like, I'm picking up a, a very karmic connection here for some of you, Taurus, meaning, like, um, some of you could be like maybe married to somebody that is literally just you feel like just sucking the life from you or like, you know, you just feel like you're trying to save money and you feel like you can't save money because maybe this person spends more or whatever. Like there's a there's a thing here with you working so hard, kind of like a hamster on a spinning wheel. And it almost seems like endless and pointless because no matter how hard you work, you feel like you're not making enough. Right. That's the toxic energy that needs to be let go. Because now, if you let go of this energy, when you invest, the money will start to come in and flow and it won't be wasted, okay? So be mindful of that. Be mindful of the money munchers and all that, you know, all that stuff because you don't want to go there. All right, so let's see. What's the career advice for my Tauruses? What's the career advice for my Tauruses? Trusting, yep, trust, believe, and step up. Okay, so you guys got trust, believe, and step up. So trust, implement a solid marketing plan that builds your clients' trust in you. When you show up consistently for them, they'll know that you care. I say this a lot to you guys because I a lot of times I always sense that sometimes you guys may want to cut corners with certain things, but I'm telling you, doing that is gonna make you lose more clientele than if you were to bring in more clientele, all right? Because Believe. It says say yes to believing in yourself and in your business vision. Move forward knowing that your success is assured. So like for some of you, I'm getting like sometimes you feel like you have to cut corners because you feel like people are not being reasonable for like your prices or something like that. You need to stick to your guns because the people that will be okay with it are the ones that you're going to attract to you, but you cannot think of it in a negative way. All right. And then it says step up. Don't be the best kept secret in your niche. Boost your visibility. Step out of the shadows and into the spotlight to attract your ideal clients. Yeah, a lot of you need to advertise yourselves more. Like those of you who has businesses, a lot of you need to advertise yourself more because the more that you're out there, you have that energy already that you exude naturally. You'll start to get the opportunities, but you just have to be seen first. Okay, and then what crystal message do we have to end the reading? Thank you. Yep, clear the clutter selenite so definitely making sure you keep your energy cleared um taurus and then also like i said letting go of that toxic energy okay letting go of that toxic energy all right that's what i have for you guys this month i hope you guys enjoy don't forget to like comment share subscribe and i'll see you in the next one bye guys